Hello boys and girls. Welcome to peek over my shoulder in Call of Pripyat Special Edition. This is the part where I leave the uh, mutant hunting equipment at home and get ready for some action. And by action I mean at the uh, water treatment plant. So I'm going to I'm going to spy on some uh, mercs now. Now there was a firefight here before. I'm gonna ignore that, I think. <coughs> oh yes, please put do that in my boxes. Well, there's nobody here now. I did hear shooting before, but... Hmm... Campfire at the sawmill again... But that could mean anything. Before there was also a fire and nobody was there. Still, let's do a quick scan. A very quick scan. What about the caves? I mean, when it comes to the caves, I know that I can just check and come back later because nobody else comes to the caves. Okay, I can see at least two doodads. So that was the second. Anything over here? Yeah, I think it's just two. Okay. How much blood clotters do I have? I think let's stick with the health booster. And let's let's put the tricorder away. Pardon the joke. Because right now we're we're doing serious business, yo. Yeah, let let the let the others Hunt for artifacts for a change. Wasn't I friendly with loners? I suppose not. Maybe I was friendly with uh, certain groups. That can also happen. Okay, I have grenades, I have ammo. to approach from this side because this means a very quick access to the pipes. <laughs> also should probably eat something. can do it without getting killed once. <laughs> right. Of 
course, if there was a blowout happening while I'm sneaking in, I could uh, combine several uh, forces. I could uh, snatch the uh, the laptop and do whatever I like uh, after that, because they would be confined to one room. This is my moral event horizon. I have no quarrel with the marks. And I'm about to just flat out attack them. So I'm gonna try it so that I don't save in the middle of uh, my shenanigans. Now I should I sh should go up here because some patrols down there are looking outside, so they could see me. These are their footsteps, not mine. I think that the guard at this door won't be able to see me yet. No? Mm, we was never here. the ladder over here. Okay, now comes the dangerous part. Somebody might be looking this way. But they're not. <laughs> I didn't realize you could get on top of these. Uh, I'm gonna make a separate save here, just so that I can return to it. So this is this is for extracurricular activities. I intend to return to the save and, and try to jump on top of these uh, uh, roofs. Uh, no. <laughs> okay, now comes the sneaky part. Sneaky, 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 sneaky. I personally have never managed to snatch the laptop and just leave. I mean, people tell me that it's possible, but I don't know, they might have been using a different difficulty, because as far as I'm concerned, the moment, yes, somebody's moving over there, the moment you grab it, everybody's alerted, and also uh, some of the guys can see you through the grating. Okay, this guy can see me already. Or not. Yeah, maybe <coughs> maybe you have to pay attention to the guard routes if you want to just snatch the laptop and, and leave. 
Okay, so one guy's over there. This is where I start panicking. I don't remember if there was anybody on the second level. Can I get behind that pillar? No. Oh, I think the guy that I saw was not on the second level, but uh, the level below, and I could just see him through. Yeah. Oh, there, there they are. Okay, that's this. This makes things easier. So I have to. I no longer have to sneak now. I just have to shoot. Present for you, so yeah, I can't pop out too much. <laughs> oh, I think I broke the vodka. Where are you? Ah, oh, he moved. Darn it. Mm -mm. It might actually be more useful to use the pistol here. Because looking through the scope will mess with my vision now. Hey yo! Oops! Fuck! Ow, 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 ow. They are definitely on the move now. <laughs> Two left. Okay, one was just here. Yeah, I will stick with the pistol because then I can shoot through here like that. This is a good pipe, sturdy pipe. Ah, oh, shit! Okay, let's do it all over. Wait, which which save are we gonna load now? Tactic 
local T. Okay, so it's, it's this one here. Let's switch to pistol. Note to self, don't blow yourself up. right now they are not on alert yet so a peaceful outcome might still be possible theoretically I mean hypothetically but again in practice I have I have never done it so oh Right, so this part is true. You can grab the laptop without alerting them. The trouble is getting out. So somebody, somebody claimed to me once that they were able to uh, jump back into the pipe, which is what I was very clumsily trying to do here, which might not be the brightest idea. Like you would have. To jump the top of the railing first I, I take it oh there's one guy right here and he goes over there and then where I don't know so he's the one who was probably seeing us oh, okay so you should jump over here Well, so much about that. Uh, where? Oh, okay, let's. I think. I think I'm not that good of a sneaker. Let's start shooting right away. So basically, stealthy way is possible, but it's not for everybody. Still, I can spend some time. And no, can I? Can I not take the? Oh, okay. I can't take the scope off. Where is this guy now? Hello? Anybody? I'm right here. I'm gonna make one more peaceful attempt. Which failed. Okay, I'm done. I'm, I'm just gonna shoot them. Besides, different merc groups each operate separately, so it's not like it's not like they have too much love for each other. Uh, also, I think when I reload, then uh, there alert status changes anyway, so they are already on alert. Okay, let's see if we can wait for the sky to emerge. I can hear him patrolling somewhere nearby. Yeah, I 
think uh, doing it the stealthy way uh, that is uh, grabbing the laptop and uh, and uh, getting to the railing and getting back to the pipe requires you to know very well what the guards are doing and when not just jumping in at any point which means you have to sit and study the guard routes and the timings and I ain't got patience for that different style of gameplay pro okay one guy's down there but where's the guard on this level that's that's what I care about the most yo hello I'm here Ah, oh, shit. I left my elbow or something exposed. Darn it. stealthy fiascos I kind of stop counting so I don't even know which attempt this is six seven I don't know I'm still not gonna save I'm still gonna try to do it all in one go So if I understand correctly, the guard on this level... Ah yeah, there he comes. Liquid smooth. expose myself too much. Also, these grenades are better because no shards. Granata! Did I take damage? Minimal.
do this. Отходим! I've definitely wounded them, but it seems that I have killed only one. One of the exo guys is gone. Here, one set of footsteps. Just pop some pills. So we had at least this one jumpsuit and one EXO has left for certain. Probably a sneaky one. Just, just checking. a bit of dilemma. It could be that the last one is ambushing or it could be that they're just uh, wounded from the grenade blast and uh, I can't see. Um, so 
so because of that I would say that I am gonna do a quick save here and try to oh so that was indeed the case Howdy, fellas. So I want to try the thing. If I grab the laptop from here, can I... Can I get... Yeah, so you can easily get back here. I mean, if you... If you do it just right, then it shouldn't be too complicated. That's what I wanted to know. Meanwhile, however, let us loot. Take it all and then distribute. that bread <laughs> uh, okay um, so scatter the scopes I will clean up later Scopes to stalkers. I don't think it's uh, it's worth lugging around the knives, though. So this pistol might be worth keeping and selling. So. Last guy. Ah. Oh. Well then. <clears throat> now that we have come barged in and murdered a ton of dudes, let's take a look around a little bit. It's been a while, so I don't remember what's where. So let's check the indicators. Nope, no new numbers. I think when they go on alert, then everybody comes running. The guy at this door and the guy at the other door, and it's it's still useful to check. Or whatever this room pulses as. Don't mind if I do. I 
did or did I or did I not uh, take the stash in the truck outside? I don't remember. Also, I remember being very paranoid that there might be a stash atop of some of these events, but I never managed to find any. Oh, or maybe inside the vents, I don't remember. I don't remember anything, really. I think they gather in this room when there's a blowout. So let's say you wait for a blowout, you sneak in through the pipes, and if you then happen to pop some grenades in the room, which would be a very, very evil thing to do, you might be able to get rid of the whole squad very easily. Or, well, very um, quickly and crudely. This one will lead to the upright pipe that you can get in through. This one is also blocked. Okay, here we go. So what I don't remember is where there are any stashes in this area, like period or were there any stashes in this area that I didn't clear and this thingy is one of my suspicion points all the time now let's check the other thingy I think that's in Jupiter where there's a stash in, in the identical thingy Okay, numbers are good. Let's go check the truck. What's this? Oh, gas. I think I've, yeah, I've already cleared this one. I think I I might have counted some double. Let's let's start again. So on this on this
is hot. Forty three and uh, the numbers I remember from somebody were like forty six or fifty two even, so there there are a few stashes out here that I have not found. In fact the area around the this this facility is awfully clear of the markers. I mean there there are there are the uh mission stashes here so that's maybe that that's maybe uh changing the stats a little bit but still who's over there like, are there people I wanna sell my stuff, stuff to? Bandits, why not? Uh, let's swing by the uh, scar as well, because I think we haven't been there after the next, um, uh, next blowout. Ah, no, wait. The blowout happened when we were on the plateau, so we did swing by here, I think. Still, doesn't hurt to double check. Very lone bandit. Yo. Ну типа я слушаю. So I'm I'm keeping this one. However, how about a pistol? Uh, some vodka. Some more vodka. A sausage. And uh, some bread. Eh? Eh? My weight balance is immediately happier. I'm gonna check the loaders camp as well. I mean, there were a bunch of circus anomaly weren't there. Okay, so right now, even though it's raining, the frame rate seems to have eased up, so I think it was my polar zipping shenanigans before that gave me all the stutter. back uphill while we're at it. Also sprinting might not be our thing right now. At least not until we've done some business with other people.
there's a campfire there, but I think that's the sawmill or the uh, gas field. Right now my agenda is to peddle off some of the loot and then I want to check the uh, underhill caves. one of you is the leader, the one who sits of course. Yo. some more vodka because it's heavy. Half a kilo. Okay, sausages are the heaviest. Опять сапожищи хреновые подсунули. Что у них совсем совести нет в этих? За неделю подошвы гоплык. I need I need a quiet place to read. <laughs> Sorry dude. Save here. And let's get somewhere in between everything. I don't remember if these mercs had anything to say about you clearing out the other area. So I should probably get on on the rocks. Okay. So, what does it say? Notebook! The Mert's notebook. No, I wanna read. Save Morsh's... Morsh's... Spam... If Pochtavon Yashke No book so there Oh my god, I'm starting to say Russian like an English person. Sredi Mojasto Spama I a Pochnam Yashke No book so there is it's a Edinichistani Edi Единственное сообщение. Помеченное как важное. So, among all the, all the spam in, this, uh, in the laptop's uh, uh, mailbox, there is one message that looks important. Организуйте лагерь на станции переработки охотов. Каждый, кто участвует в теле. Каждый, кто участвует в теле, будет прибывать к вам. Черного не ждите. Он с людьми будет на Юпитере. Окей, set up a camp in the in the dudad. Don't wait for the black one. He is already in Jupiter. Он с людьми будет на Юпитере, у него своя задача. Oh, and he has his own mission. Военные тормоз... тормознули полеты в зоне, как что от них неприятностей не будет. Okay, so the military won't be a problem. Well, I guess the joke's on you, buddy. Как-то сталкеры найдут путь в Припять, пришлом... 
проводника и будем ждать там людей заказчика они покажут где лаборатория шакал so the message is from jackal and they have been standing by until uh, stalkers uh, find a way to prepare and then they shall be standing by to uh, to find the the labs Huh, I think that's that's actually the most information I have gotten from the laptop uh, in all my gameplay because I think all the stalker gameplay has improved my Russian a little bit. When I was playing the first time, the English tr translation wasn't out yet, so uh, I had to I had no choice. I had to run by Russian uh, audio as well as written text, and I don't think I figured out as much that back then. Okay, what else did we get? Zone history, three of one, five. Mutants, pseudo dog again. Zone history, one of five. I think I've got that one many, many times. Zone guide, garbage. How about the PDAs? So PDA from Hrypt. I don't know what's his English name. Last mission. Не удалось договориться нас насчет оружия. Этот шаг жадюка радость нам припасы своей группировки. Oh, okay, they are about to get some smuggled guns from uh, Morgan. Обойдется в общем не дорога, но придется тащиться к Юпитеру. Гриф! And this one. PDA of Kruk. Nice names. Крепт и Крюк. Я не знаю, что их английские имена. Последнее входное сообщение. Пока торчим больше каких-то старых цехов. Я послал твоих вперед Раз... разведать к вам дорогу. Пока не отмет. А пьявец курьер от заказчиков будем ждать здесь. Тут воздух ясно свежее. Uh, somebody is waiting for them somewhere. Oh, okay. This is the squad who is at uh, the Jupiter plant, I think. Chisak. Матрайчу торчим возле каких-то стар старых цехов. Uh, so, old assembly, something something old assembly lines. Something about the courier with the mission information. Maybe, yeah. So, <laughs> the info isn't completely. I'm I'm not as much in the dark as I was during my very first gameplay, uh, very first playthrough. But I'm a little bit uh, fuzzy on the details still. Let's see how the other mercs are taking all this. Yellow. Peekaboo. Oh, wait. Okay, so... Oh, this is the suck. So... Basically, these guys have set up here. I guess... I guess it could be a factory? 
The thing is that when I read the information that I only understand partially, I tend to extrapolate stuff that isn't really there, and uh, sometimes I extrapolate in it in such a way that it matches with something else, which isn't really the uh, which isn't really what it's about. So in this case. When they said old assembly lines, I, I figured that they might be talking about the Jupiter plant, but actually they were talking about this factory here. Sleep, leave the snorks alone. And one more objective for today was to check the caves. However, before I do that, I think I will I will stop the episode here. Talk to these uh, nice friendly bandits and carry on in the next one. So I have some more business I still left in Zaton. For now, thank you very much for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye!